Hello, my name is Jennifer Perry, and I'm the Director of Public Works for the Town of Exeter. We're here at the recently completed groundwater treatment plant on Larry Lane. This treatment plant takes drinking water from wells at Gilman Park and Larry Lane and treats it and provides drinking water for the town. This is a perfect example of many of the recent infrastructure improvement projects that the Public Works Department has brought for the town of Exeter. Public Works is also responsible for the maintenance of roads and bridges, water lines, sewer lines, drain lines. We also provide for drinking water treatment and wastewater treatment, making sure that we don't pollute downstream waters. We provide for the collection of residential solid waste and promote recycling. We provide the maintenance of municipal fleet and heavy equipment and fueling. And we also provide for the maintenance of all town-owned buildings and make sure that those buildings are warm and comfortable for the occupants and residents alike. Public Works works closely with all municipal departments and in particular, I'd like to mention the Parks and Recreation Department, who is responsible for maintaining playing fields and bringing many excellent and exciting recreational opportunities for residents. Public Works would like to thank you for your support during many of these important infrastructure projects that we've completed and are about to undertake. We also wanna thank you for your patience during construction which can bring in temporary inconveniences, but in the long term will build for the future of Exeter. Public Works makes it happen. We hope you appreciate this short Public Works announcement from the New England chapter of American Public Works Association. You're watching a broadcast brought to you by the New England chapter of the American Public Works Association. Public Works makes it happen. Welcome everyone to another favorite pastime classic, your Thanksgiving Day football game. Two communities gather for their rival competition. An event made possible by months of mental and physical preparation. The players, the coaches, but who else has been hard at work? Your Department of Public Works. Months before the coin toss, the grounds division maintains the surface, from fertilizing and mowing to painting the field. But it's not just the grounds division that's been busy. The highway division has been doing their own painting too. Did you know it takes over a year to complete a road paving project? There's more that goes into it than the surface you see. The water that flows from the tap and the wastewater that flushes and drains travels the road just as you do. There are many utilities that need to be addressed before crews can pave. Now it's game day. Public Works crews thought the field was ready for play, but Mother Nature seems to have played games of her own. In the early morning hours, while most of our listeners prepare that Thanksgiving turkey, Public Works crews arrive long before anyone else to ensure the safety and comfort of the players, families, and friends.
As New Englanders, we've all been there. Year after year, it seems we must clear endless piles of snow from our walkways and driveways. At the same time, public works crews perform their duties around the clock to remove snow from hundreds of miles of road. And it's not just the roads that need to be cleared. Sidewalks, parking lots, bus stops, schools, parks, cemeteries, city or town hall, senior centers, and other municipal buildings. It's an endless list of concerns that our public works must address to ensure the safety and functions of our cities and towns. Quarterback in a shotgun formation, twin receivers to the wide side right. There's a bomb downfield, and it is picked off. At midfield, he's going to take it all the way back for a touchdown. Doesn't that colorful foliage make for a beautiful sight? But public works crews know it's just a matter of time before those leaves cause a problem that no one wants to see. Keeping gutter lines and storm drains clean is essential to maintaining safe, passable streets, dry homes, and accessible business. Are you guys serious? Dude, dude, what, what did I tell you about lining up? No matter how good you are on the field, there are always challenges to overcome and staying hydrated is part of that game plan. Providing safe, clean water is the essential responsibility of our public works department. Cities and towns draw their water from watersheds and resource areas which must be properly managed. Before water can be delivered to your home, our public water must go through multiple stages of treatment to meet primary standards for health and safety, as well as secondary standards for odor, color, and taste. Once treated, the water is ready to be delivered through pipe networks to homes and business. Oliver, I'm going to get a drink. And now for that halftime snack. Now we need the spatula. The smell of hot chocolate and fresh popcorn lures you to the snack bar. And while you were busy licking the salt off your fingers, you might not have realized that the wind blew your empty container under the stands. And neither did hundreds of other people. Thankfully, public works crews stick around long enough after the game to ensure it all gets picked up. And off to the running back going right up the middle, he breaks the tackle and keeps going for a touchdown. All that while the trash was being emptied. We've come to the end of regulation time. As today's Thanksgiving Day game comes to a close, public works crews will return to the field and ensure it's ready for the next sports season. These are just a few examples of how public works strives to enhance our everyday lives. Throughout the day and night, public works is on the job. In sun, rain, and snow, they're the silent arm of public safety. From all of us here at the New England chapter of the American Public Works Association Stadium, until next time, thank you and farewell. Contact your local Department of Public Works for information on what your community provides for service.